Hi there, this is Apostle Karen Proctor, and I just feel led to pray for you today, to pray for your family. Uh, I'm just coming from working out. That's why you see my cap on and I'm covered up because I have all my workout clothes. But I just wanted to stop and take this minute to pray for you. There is so much going on in the family unit today. But there is nothing that prayer could not change if you just believe. I was thinking about the word of the Lord in Psalms 138 and verse 8. It says, the Lord will perfect that which concerns me. Thy mercy, O Lord, endure forever. Forsake not the works of thy own hands. So whatever it is that uh, is concerning you today, I want you to know that God is concerned about you. God is concerned about your family. So whether it's a, a marital situation whether it's a single person, whether you're lonely. In fact, Psalms uh, 68 and verse 6 says that God set the lonely in families. He bringing out those which are bound with chains, but the rebellious dwell in a dry land. So no matter whether you're single, whether you're lonely, whether you're having a marital problem, whether it's an issue with your child or your children, whether you are barren and you've been trying to have children, God is concerned about you. If it's your financial situation, if you're having a financial hardship, if you're having problems on your job, problems in your neighborhood, uh, issues in your family, among siblings, uh, if your inheritance is tied up, if you need to be loose from a generational curse, no matter what your issue is, God is concerned about it. And he says, where any two touch and agree on anything, he says, it shall be done for us of our Father in heaven. So I want to touch and agree with you today. I really know the power of prayer. Hallelujah. God is ready to answer you. He said before we even call on him, he would answer us. So let's pray. Father God, in the precious name of Jesus, I come before your throne of grace Lord, humble as I know how, bow down to you, Lord God, but yet bold because you told us to come bold that we may find grace and mercy in our hour of need. Lord God, I want to pray for that one that may be having a problem in the marriage. Lord, you say whatever we bind on earth is bound in heaven. Whatever we loose on earth is loosed in heaven. So I bind up every marital problem in the name of Jesus. Every spirit of confusion that's between the husband and wife. I bind your powers. I deactivate your confusion in the name of Jesus. And I send you back to the pit of hell from which you come. And I lose peace, love, and understanding between husbands and wives. And Lord God, I pray for that single man, that single woman that's trusting you for a mate, Lord God. God, there is nothing too hard for you to do, God. God, I pray that you will put them in the right location at the right time, that you will hook them up with the right person. Lord God, I know that you're able to do it. Lord God, I pray for that person that's believing for healing for that loved one. Lord God, you say that healing is the children's bread. And right now, Lord God, you say by Jesus stripes, we are already healed. So we release the healing virtue of Christ Jesus to begin to flow over that loved one like never before. We bind every spirit of infirmity. We come against you with the sword of the spirit dipped in the blood of Jesus. I command you to loose the bodies in the name of Jesus. Loose them, Father, in the name of Jesus. <coughs> God, we just thank you for how you're doing it. God, I pray for those that are having a challenge on their job. 
Lord God, we pray today in the name of Jesus that you will give them favor with their co-workers, give them favor with their bosses, with their directors, with their managers, oh God. Everything that the enemy mean for harm on their job, we rebuke it in the name of Jesus. We cancel the plan of the enemy and we loose the promise of God even over the job in the name of Jesus. Lord God, you say that you shall bless the work of our hands. Oh, God, and we thank you for doing it right now, God. God, that person that needs their rent paid, that is short in rent money, that is short in the mortgage, Father. God, you say that you would give us favors with our creditors, with our lenders, oh, God. And God, I'm asking you today, Father, that favor is their portion with the lenders, oh, God, with the creditors, with the mortgage company, with the rent person, Father God. Lord, we asking you to make a way of escape, Father, like only you can do it, Father. God, we thank you and we praise you, Father. God, we believe in you today, Father, for that mother, that father that does not know where their child is at this time. Lord, we call that child home. We call them home in the name of Jesus. Father, that not after many hours hence from now, Father, that that child, hallelujah, location shall be revealed in the name of Jesus. That child shall pick up the phone and say, Mom, or dad, I am all right, mom, dad, I'm on my way home. I decree it and I declare it in the name of Jesus. And Lord God, I pray, Father God, for those siblings that are at odds with each other right now, God. God, I bind up that spirit of confusion in the name of Jesus between siblings. God, I, I loose the spirit of love, the spirit of peace between siblings right now, God. God, we just believe you for the family, Lord God. Those that are believing for the lost loved ones, Father. God, I believe you that today is the appointed time that their loved ones, hallelujah, shall bow down and say, I yield, I yield. What must I do to be saved? Father, we call them. We call them from the guttermost, even unto the uttermost. God, we thank you. We thank you, Father. We thank you that they're going to begin to call on on the name of Jesus like never before. God, we thank you that salvation is their portion. God, I thank you. Lord, you're able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that we could ask or think. God, we thank you. God, we thank you. We praise you. God, you say, even when we don't know how to pray, as we ought to pray, Lord, you say that the Holy Spirit will make intercession for us. Lord, we thank you, sweet Holy Spirit. I'm asking you right now to begin to make intercession, oh God, for the family right now. I decree and declare hallelujah over that loved one that's in jail, that's in prison. Father God, that you're going to protect them, Father, behind the prison wall, oh God. Those that have been falsely incarcerated, God, I believe by the authority of Christ Jesus. Hallelujah, that their case is coming up, oh God, and that you're going to give them favor, Father, and that they're going to be loose from the bands of wickedness now, God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Lord God, I believe you, Father, for that one that's by the bedside, Father, of a sick loved one, oh God. God, it ain't over until you say it's over, God. God, I speak healing, Father. I speak healing. Oh God, that one that's in the coma, Father. God, they're waking up out of the coma even now. Even now. Arise, arise, arise. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Oh God, that, that one that's believing for that loved one that's on crack, that's using flocker, God that's using all manner of drugs and alcohol I break that curse, 
I break it in the name of Jesus. I command you to loose your hold. Loose your hold off of God's property in the name of Jesus. God, they're going to lose that taste. They're going to lose that taste for drugs. They're going to lose that taste for alcohol. Even now, even now, God, quicken their spirits unto your spirit, Father. Quicken their spirits unto your spirit, Father. <coughs> In the name of the Lord Jesus, God, I thank you. Lord, I thank you right now, God. Oh, yes, God, I hear you, Holy Spirit. That one that's in that predicament, that's in that dilemma, that seemed like it's too hard for them. Oh, God, you say nothing is too hard for those that believe. Father God, I believe you for the impossible. God, that you're making a way of escape right now, God. That you're giving them wisdom in this hour, God. You're giving them a spirit of discernment, Father, in the name of Jesus. Jesus, God, that they shall see their way clear now in the name of Jesus. God, I thank you that blind eyes are coming open. Hallelujah. Deaf ears are being unstopped. Even now, God, the lame is walking. Oh, I hear you. Somebody's believing God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah for a for a loved one that's been paralyzed, that's been sitting in the wheelchair. Hallelujah! This is your hour. This is their hour. What about Your petition has come up before the Lord. Hallelujah! They're gonna get up. They're gonna astound the doctors. They're gonna astound their loved ones. Hallelujah! In the name of Jesus, I speak to those dry bones, and I command you to get up. I command you to walk again. In in the name of Jesus, I prophesy over your bone. I prophesy over your nerve ending. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Restoration in your nerve ending. Even now, even now, even now. Hallelujah. God, I thank you. Oh, God. Oh, yatato. Rabashako. Rimashandiriku. Rabashake. Rumamama shakata. Rubashakete. Oh, yes, God. Yes, God. Yes. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Is somebody out there praying for a miracle in their family? Hallelujah. You saying, God, hallelujah. I need a touch from you. My family need a touch from you. God, I need you to do it. Hallelujah. You've been praying and you've been believing God. Hallelujah. But you still feel like you in a position of stagnation. I break that stagnation off of you now. I break it off of you. I break it off of your family. In in the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Miracle shall meet you today. Hallelujah. You shall collide with a miracle today. Hallelujah. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. I prophesy your miracle is coming to your family today. In the name of Jesus, you shall give testimony. Hallelujah. On what the Lord has did for you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Terobo sherandido macha. Rikandalo bo sorakata. Rimama shikatata. Raba shikatata. Yes, God. Yes, God. Somebody out there praying for a loved one. Hallelujah. I don't know if it's cataracts in your eye. Warababa shakatata. And you're scared to go to the doctor. Hallelujah. Somebody is loose in sight. Hallelujah. It's something in your sight. Hallelujah. I come against it in the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You shall not lose your sight. Hallelujah. I bind that spirit of fear. And I loose, I loose the spirit of faith. Hallelujah. 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 Glory be to God. Hallelujah. You will not lose your eyesight. Hallelujah. 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 Begin to exercise your faith in God. Hallelujah. As Jesus Christ was in the earth, so are you. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. 
Somebody's going to get an x-ray today. Hallelujah. Somebody's got to take a loved one. Hallelujah. To get an x-ray today. Hallelujah. And then there are some that are praying for family members. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The doctor say you need an x-ray. Hallelujah. Glory be to God to see the root of the problem. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Don't have no fear. Hallelujah. I prophesy. Hallelujah. Go and take that x-ray. Hallelujah. Shakata. God has given you a clean bill of health. Health. Hallelujah. Glory be to God when that when you take that x-ray. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. It's not going to be what the doctor is assuming. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. This is your hour. This is your hour for supernatural turnaround. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Even as you're listening to this prayer, I want you to come into agreement. God is beginning to shift the atmosphere right in that very place to Rabba Shakata that you are listening. Nida Ma Shakota Ramama Shakata and yes somebody's gonna pull this video up even at work or Rabba Shakata in the atmosphere on your job it's gonna begin to shift Uraba Sheretete Rabba Shakata Hallelujah Hallelujah Glory be to God God is concerned Hallelujah about that which Hallelujah concerns you. Hallelujah. Can I tell you today that God is getting ready to perfect that which concerns you. Hallelujah. Yes, even that one. Hallelujah. That say, I got to lose some weight. And you've been trying. God is putting his super on your natural today. Hallelujah. You're even going to have a desire to eat right. Hallelujah. You're going to get a desire to begin to exercise. Hallelujah. And the way that's going to come on for you supernatural. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Can I tell you today that God is concerned about your family. God is concerned about your children. God is concerned about every daughter. God is concerned about every son. Yes, yes, yes. God is concerned about your mother. God is concerned about your father. God is concerned about that tumultuous marriage that you're going through. Hallelujah. Somebody out there is in an abusive relationship. Hallelujah. God is making a way of escape for you even now. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You say, God, if I leave, where could I go? Hallelujah. But daughter, God is concerned about you today. Hallelujah. He's making a way of escape for you today. Hallelujah. Somebody got a heavy burden. Hallelujah. For that son. Hallelujah. God is going to turn him around. And as a matter of fact, even as I speak now, hallelujah, God is turning him around. Yokes are being destroyed. Burdens are being lifted. Shackles are being removed. Hallelujah. I hear the Lord say, you don't have no idea. Hallelujah. How much God loves you. God loves you with an everlasting love. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And that situation that you're in. Hallelujah. God told me to tell you. He's getting ready to perfect it. Hallelujah. God is getting ready to perform a brand new thing in your life. Hallelujah. I came in the authority. Hallelujah. Of the prophet that's on the inside of me. Hallelujah. I prophesy to every dry bone in your life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You're going to breathe again. You're going to live again. Hallelujah. You've been at Rumashikonda in a state of depression. Hallelujah. But you're coming up out of that state of depression. Hallelujah. The hands of the wicked one loose you now in the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I wasn't going to wait until I go and 
fix my hair. I wasn't going to wait until I go and put on makeup. Hallelujah. Just come from working out. God say go and pray for my people now. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Somebody need to move. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God is going to make the way. Hallelujah. You don't have no idea. Hallelujah. How this move is going to take place. Hallelujah. But God got his hand upon it. God have his hand upon this move. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. You was just told to vacate the premises. Hallelujah. I want you to vacate. Hallelujah. In the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God is going to give you a better place. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Even as you begin to leave. Hallelujah. I want you to know right now that your footsteps are being ordered. Your footsteps are being ordered by the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. To Roba Shandere Bosa, Rama Shekon, Derebe, Serandelo Boso, Ricadata, Yetete, Randelo Bosata, Ricondelo Mashidando Robosha. Is somebody Yenda La Basakototo, Rama Shekete, your family inheritance? Hallelujah, we're being tied up. Hallelujah, but I prophesy today in the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, glory be to God. That it's coming to transfer a wealth. Hallelujah, glory be to God. The thing that the enemy was trying to stop. Hallelujah, by way of your inheritance. Hallelujah, glory be to God. Hallelujah, I hear the Lord. That transfer that transfer of inheritance hallelujah it's coming to you and it's coming into your bosom hallelujah yes it was a delay but it's not being denied it is not being denied says the spirit of the living lord hallelujah Hallelujah, you shall come and give testimony. You shall come back and give testimony how God is working in your life, how God is intervening in your family life. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Somebody is concerned about your daughter. Hallelujah, she took a turn. Hallelujah, glory be to God and you have raised her right. Hallelujah. Glory be to God, but she took a turn. Hallelujah, that's not pleasing unto you. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God say, don't worry. Hallelujah. He's got a hook in her belly. Hallelujah. She can't get far. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, I call her in. I call her back into the kingdom of God. I call her from the darkness even now. In the name of Jesus. Sheila, 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 Sheila. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I arrest every spirit that's not like God in Sheila. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, Rabba Shere Terebosa. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, God, come up higher. Come up higher. Come up higher. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Mother, don't worry. Hallelujah. God, have somebody out there witnessing to her. Hallelujah. She's turning back. She's turning back to the Lord. Hallelujah. I want you to begin to lift your hands and give God praise. Give God praise. Hallelujah. Give God praise for the supernatural turnaround. Give God praise for the intervention. Hallelujah. That's taking place in her life. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I don't care what you're going through. Hallelujah. God is concerned about you. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And then there's one out there. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You're concerned about vacation. I don't know if it's the, the time that you want to take off from your job and your boss is not authorizing it. I don't know if it's the money. Hallelujah. Glory be to God that you need. Hallelujah. But I want to let you know today. God is concerned about you. Hallelujah. And that vacation, that vacation is yours. 
says the spirit of the living Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Oh, and your life is going to be transformed as a result of this vacation. Hallelujah. Your life is going to be transformed as a result of this vacation. Hallelujah. There's nothing too hard for God to do. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Everything, everything that concerns you, God is concerned about it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Even that one that's 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 pregnant with child, that's having a difficulty pregnancy. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I want you to believe the report of the Lord. Hallelujah. The report of the Lord is everything is going to be all right. Hallelujah. Everything is going to be all right. Hallelujah. The pregnancy. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The end result of this pregnancy is going to be all right. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Rabba sere nderebo so rabba se rukonda la masiram dereku rabba sekete even that gentleman. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You're you you're believing God for a job. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And, and you just believe in God just for a job. Hallelujah. Glory be to God just for a job to make ends meet. Hallelujah. But God is going to give you more than just a job to make ends meet. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God is going to show itself mighty to you. Hallelujah. God is going to put you in a position that you don't even qualify for. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And you're going to know that it's the Lord's doing. Hallelujah. And it's going to be marvelous in your sight. Hallelujah. You're going to come back. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And you're going to make testimony. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And yes, yes, yes. It, it's one out there. Hallelujah. You believe in God. Hallelujah. Something to do with your taxes. Hallelujah. You owe tax money. Hallelujah. And you're saying, God, I don't know how I'm going to do this. Hallelujah. And then there's another out, of, out there. Hallelujah. Somebody has frivolously took in your social security number. Hallelujah. And filed erroneous taxes. Hallelujah. In your name. Hallelujah. God is squaring that away. Hallelujah. God is going to square it away. Hallelujah. Don't lose hope. Hallelujah. God is going to fix it for you. Hallelujah. 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 Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. I bind generational hexes. I bind generational curses. I bind you to the most surrendable sata back to 40 generations in the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Tell about shit under the bosa. Rick under the robo shata. Come on and lift your hands. Come on and lift your hands. Hallelujah. Tell the Lord thank you. Tell about shatata. Rick under the bosa robo shakata. Tell the Lord thank you for freeing your family. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Begin to cry out to the mashakata, to the true and the living God. Come on, begin to repent of those family sins. God is making a way of escape for your family. Even now, even now. There's a breaker's anointing. To break the bands of wickedness. To break the band of wickedness. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Yera ba sherete lo ba sarata rikanda lo bo sata. Beloved, this is Apostle, Prophetess Karen Proctor. Hallelujah! Just joining in agreement with you, and in the word of the Lord, Psalms one thirty eight and verse eight, whereby it reads, "The Lord will perfect that which concerns thee." Hallelujah. Be strengthened in the might and in the power 
of Almighty God. I've prayed these prayers in the name that's above every name, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And you shall experience the results of these prayers. Some of you seconds. Some of you are going to experience the results in minutes. Others of you will experience results in the coming days, in the coming months. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Be blessed. Have a blessed day. Keep your faith in God. Hold up your head and know that God has heard you. God bless you. And if you have a personal prayer that you want me to agree with you on, you can reach me at Miss Ms. Karen Proctor at gmail.com. God bless you and have a wonderful day.